Hello friends, welcome back to e-commerce project in Laravel 10. Last video I will show you how to show like a category and subcategory wise routes. Like you can click on the category, so it's category wise. Suppose you can click on the subcategory, so subcategory wise works. Suppose I click on the fashion, so you can see it like fashion wise. Suppose I go to like a category like kid clothing, so it's a kid clothing wise works. So it's very well works, no issue. You can see it here. Okay. So one minute is the one error there about the MySQL select category where is lux is category is deleted accident okay because I have not started my server this is the problem otherwise no any issue let me start my servers okay so let's refresh the page okay server now started is the I have used two screen this reasons okay server is not started this reason generate the issue otherwise no any issue okay now I go to like a shower so it is a category subcategory routes we have created suppose you are following the series so you can see it and sorry about that we have lots of delay for this new video for this product means that this is the video developing take time but we can continue now I just back to work and we can continue okay and I want to request you are new in this channel otherwise in this series so please subscribe and please press the bell icon so you always get the notification and you can learn always new things okay I hope you can done now and now we can continue like a creating meta title and meta description suppose this category I will choose like a smartphone so we need to show he is a title here suppose we are showing he is a title so okay here so you can see it like a last video we have done like a, suppose I can choose the fashion so he is choosing fashion but we need to make like SEO related SEO means search engine optimization Google always face like a search engine optimization whatever you are typing let's go to your uh, layout inside app folder so you can in, in easily understand app layouts inside you can see it like app.blade.php so here you can see it like our title there our keywords there our meta description there so this is the main part for the SEO suppose SEO is not good so you can't get the order inside your like an e-commerce website because we have did like a SEO is good for the URL you can see it like we have made like professional SEO okay for the URL I already explained how why we have did inside admin side why we need to do here so in this video I will cover like we need to make titles so how it's work title I can explain suppose I open my my database like ecommerce.com inside you can see it like a category and subcategory two tables available already so category table inside I can go so here you can see like meta title meta description meta keywords we have already done inside admin side and also you can see it inside like a subcategory so subcategory inside we have done meta title meta description meta keywords so this is the we have already done inside a admin side so we need to make dynamic like here so how we can do it it is a very easy way and I will show you very clever way okay so first of all you need to go to your routes again so routes inside web so you can see it we have done like a routes just go to down so here you can see category and subcategory routes so we are doing the front like a product front but product front where is the redirect like a product control because we have two control there like product control one is the admin side one is the front side this reason I have created alias I already explained last video but I just cover again okay so this is the product controller suppose go to HTTP inside controller inside you can see it product controller here our data is available like category means a sub category and category data you can see it and I, what why I made a condition so you can check last video so you can easily understand so now what we can do so we can do it here so here is a simple way like a just want to pass here data like a I can make like three variable right now okay dollar data meta titles same like you can go to like a your database also possible like this very simple I just creating three variable means three variable three data meta title meta keywords and meta description please carefully watch what I am doing first I am checking like a here is a category subcategory found so always we are showing the subcategory data right so it's both found so is a imp is a hundred percent is going to second one so we are going to pass like like this sub get category get sub category inside whatever there like a meta titles so just copy this key paste here and same thing we can do it here and here after we need to change our database name so just go to database name inside meta key descriptions okay I think it's copy I don't know I think copy yes and here I can do it meta keywords let's go back again and here you can see it meta keywords okay with this browser automatic copy suppose you are click on the double click so this server automatic copy this reason so here you can see it 
meta title, meta keywords, and meta description. Let's move in position right now, like this, okay? So same thing, we can do it like a category. Suppose you are search only for this category. Suppose I go to fashion, electronics. So here we need to show like electronics. So we need to do like a same thing. So what we can do, this is the like a else part, only we have search category. So just put here, okay? And here you can change the variable like subcategory to category. Suppose you can go back and you can check here like a category tables. So here you can see meta data, meta description, meta keywords is already there. You can see it. So same column we have used here. Because get category inside we are already getting. So I go to get single slug inside category model so you can see it. So what do you want to go? So app inside model inside you can see it like a category model. And also you can see it like a subcategory models here. You can see it. here is a two category and subcategory model inside we have created routes. So what you see is last video so you can understand easily. Okay. I will already provide inside a means I will provide inside a description this link for the last video. So don't worry about that. Okay. This work we have done. Okay. Here we are getting the data and we are passing. Now what we can do it just need to go to resources inside need to go to layout inside need to go to app.php. Why we are going to here suppose I am go to products instead of to list so you can see it we are already extend layout.app so layout inside app you can see it here this one so always our variable whatever you are passing here so automatic work inside app.blade.php so just you need to make here condition if is not empty meta title so we can print here otherwise null okay same thing we can do it like a keywords so keywords inside we can make like condition like this if is not empty whatever variable you declare here like a meta description there are meta keywords right now we are declared like a meta keywords so just copy and paste here is not empty and if and you can pass here Same thing you can done in like keywords, like a description, just copy and paste and you can change here like a description. So you can do it quickly. This is the reasons. Now you need to go to your again to your controllers and you need to copy again variable name like a meta description and just paste here. Let's change the position because meta title, meta description and after is a meta keywords. So look like professional, these reasons. Okay. So here you can see it like a meta description, meta description, meta keywords. Let's go back again and we can check is it working, not working. So I go back again, I refresh the page. So you can see electronics. So it is working very well because I select the electronics. So why is showing? Because here is the electronics we heard. Suppose I can add like electronics e-commerce like this e-commerce. I am just changing the database. Okay. Let's make eco. Okay. Eco only. And I just go back. I refresh the page. So you can see it here like e-commerce eco. Whatever you are doing database is automatic work. Suppose I make a control U. So here you can see the meta data meta description is not showing because of here is a blank. Suppose I can add like this data. Okay. Like here also add like this here also add and I just press control F5. So you can see meta description also available and meta keywords also available. So working very well. Let's go to back again to like subcategory laptop and computer so you can see it automatic showing so that i can open this subcategory table here so here is a laptop and computer so here is a whatever you are type inside meta title this one works suppose i can change here like a eco okay e-commerce means eco i just type i just go back again and i refresh the page so you can see it's working very well here is the only work like title whatever you did name here this is the name here work but you are did whatever here inside meta title here inside column this one work same thing you can press here control u suppose right now you are not there suppose you can add here like a echo we can add like this here okay just i made an example this reasons i will the media testing test so you can see it like an automatic show not automatic we have made code this reason show but it's working very well now this is the only category subcategory work we ever done. Okay. I just clean. I don't want to do like this. This reasons. Okay. So category subcategory inside we have made like a my data title, meta titles. We have made it dynamic. So, but I go to home page. So here you can see it like not working. You are creating any pages not working. So what we need to do? Just we need to copy every place for this code. 
and you need to go any place suppose you can go to our home page so this is our home controller you can pass here and you can pass here data now we need to pass here like a static because once we can make admin say dynamic this time we can understand how to do this one dynamic but right now i am passing only static here so just i can type only meta title like a disk e-commerce so just copy the spelling like e-commerce and i can put here only e-commerce okay so it's good let's go back again and we can refresh the page so you can see automatic showing because this is our home page and whatever we are typing here and this is the automatic showing here this is the we can make it like an admin side like we can create a new pages like admin side and this is the pages inside we can do it so don't worry about that i will show you how we can do it so we can show don't worry okay so i hope you are clear about the like a uh, how to make like a metadata meta description is dynamic category wise and how we can do it like a direct pages wise so i think is clear now next video in this video i just explain like category sub category wise meta title and meta description dynamic next video i will show you how to show product here like when to start to product here i will add admin set some products so we can work easily and i don't want to add with you suppose i will add with you so take much time and video going to long so i will add my end and after i can show directly query wise so you can add your project some product like dummy product and we can use it here and after we can show here after we can make all the dynamic step by step i can explain like how to add to cart how we can do it like a checkout everything step by step i will explain how to we can work like guests guest checkout everything i will show you i hope you can understand everything what i explained today and do you have any questions so please comment out and do you want to like this video please subscribe our error solution because we have subscriptions very low we have lots of video but subscription is very low so please help and please share your with your friend so he can learn something your friends and you are also learning i hope you can learn something today new about the how to make like a category and subcategory meta title meta description meta keywords make it dynamic okay and thank you for watching